I was the kid cleaning the stalls and biking over to McLean's every morning. Uh, I think in, in today's political climate, uh, you can either get a very positive or negative reaction from it. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. You get both ends of the spectrum right now. <laughs> yeah, it's great. I've been there since I was uh, maybe 13 or 14. And uh, I've always done my own thing on the side with my sister. And we run a business out of North Salem. And he's always had input. That's where, you know, I go when I... I need new horses and my career wouldn't be what it is without the advice and expertise that he's lended. Uh, structure. Always, you know, ride with structure, ride with a plan, train with a plan. That's a, that's a hard question to answer. What are my... I think I'm uh, very determined. I think, uh, you know, I, I don't give up easily. I'm quite stoic in that way. Sometimes I overdo things and uh, uh, that's just, that's a hard question to answer. I'm not really sure where to go with that. I'm not, I'm not sure if it's a, put me on the spot there. Uh, my sister is very involved with helping me train the horses and that kind of thing. In order to be successful, you need enough horses to ride, and there's not quite enough to, to go around for everybody. So she's, she was uh, very generous to take a step back and give me more opportunity to show. Yeah, no, she's great. She's, she's been very selfless ever since I was a little kid. It's always been you know, whatever I needed, and I, I don't know what I'd do without her. I hate losing. One of my biggest struggles is looking at it as a learning opportunity rather than losing. Yeah, it's, it's innate, you know, nobody likes to lose.